Hello, hello, everybody. Here we go with a Friday Night Magic Draft, my first brother's war draft. So let's kick this off. Draft token redeemed. All right, cracking open an Ashnod, the Flesh Mechanist. Has Death Touch, 1-1. One, one. All right, see other uncommons. We got an altar. Sack some dudes, get some mana, make a zombie. Got it. Got a Steel Seeker. Okay, so that lets me look. Ooh, whenever an artifact enters the battlefield, I get to look at the top card. Got it. And a Battery Bearer. Interesting. Let's see what any removal looking at it real quick. 30 seconds is not enough time to figure out what I'm going to do. Especially when I'm still learning all these. Ooh, there's a weak stone subjugation. That's good blue removal. Let's see, creatures I control have this can't be countered. Okay, that's a maybe. Do I want the rare? I might. One for one, one death touch is still not bad. Let's see. Hmm. I do like the skull flare. Hmm, subjugation skull flare. Oh, so many choices. I'm going to go with Skull Flare over the Mechanist, though. Picked that guy because I want to make them bigger if I have creatures in the graveyard. Let's see. We got a Keeper of the Cadence. Artifact. Okay. So, deals with some graveyard problems. Got it. Horn Stone Seeker. All right. Making Power Stones is definitely a theme I've been reading. Ooh, here we have a Rager. That's uh, always nice to draw on cards. Any removal. Looking over real quick. You have seen that Forge Chanter uh, on some of the spoiler websites. Prowess deck is something I'm very interested in getting to try. So far, though, I've got my sweet spot for black decks, and I do like getting a Rager. What else we got here? We've got an Infiltrator. Okay, if we sack some artifacts, another Skull Flare. We're going to fight the urge to make a mill deck? No. Okay. Keeper of the Cadence. Mm, that's pretty cool, but... I am going to go for card advantage artifact with unearth, a raging that I can unearth. Sold. All right, uncommons that are left. We got a bone saw. Bet they're ready. Let's see. Courser, if I want to go with some green. All right. Yotan. Oh, it's the pet guy. All right. Whenever he attacks, another creature gets a little bigger. All right. Let's see. Oh, there is a prison sentence, though. I could go black white yet again. Prison sentence is good removal. Ooh, Scatter Ray does deal with a lot of the artifacts in this set. Well, a lot of spells, too. Artifacts or creature. Very tempting. Mightstone animation. I could make my mightstones bigger. Ooh, that is a freaky looking mole. Very pink. All right. I don't really think I want the bone saw this early. Guy is coarser. No. I'm thinking prison sentence for that removal. I'm going to pick that just because I think that is the smart er pick. Prison sentence number two. All right. Also, disenchant. That would destroy a lot of things artifacts being the big big thing of the set i think all right dreams of steel and oil okay it's a uh, forced forcing them to exile it good okay swift foot boots awesome and commander edh paratrooper okay i remember reading about the blue white soldier idea still think a prison sentence number two is pretty tempting so i'm gonna go with the prison sentence I think that's my final answer. Yes, that is my final answer. Two prison sentences, please. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? Another skin flare. What's this big texty bomb here? Herkel's final meditation. Hmm, interesting, but no. No thank you. Hey, we got a recruitment officer here. What do they do? Looking at the top four cards. Reveal. Okay, maybe. Maybe. Military disciple. No. Raxo demon. Eh, two for two, two. Okay. Skull flare could get bigger. I think I want the skull flare i know the prison sentence seems pretty good though go with white if i wanted to push the officer mm, yeah we're gonna go with that another recruitment officer okay so maybe i am getting the signals that white is open with all this turn an artifact okay from the graveyard to the battlefield all right reanimation okay you can do that so far the recruitment officer would actually hit the skull flare too Okay, I like that. One for a 2-1 seems good, but so does a reanimation effect. Oof. Tough call. I'm going to go ahead and pick up the second recruitment officer for a one drop that potentially lets me do more. Yeah. Leaning towards white-black. Caress is another... Yep. Looking looking at the opponent's hand, getting to choose something, make him discard it, but you do get a Power Stone token. Engineer makes a Power Stone token. I do like that. Select that right away. Flash Paratrooper, probably not going to be going blue-white. 1-2 is okay. Flying, 
also okay. Six is caress though. I do like the idea of making more power stone tokens. However, I will do that with a creature. Stasis coffin. <laughs> okay. Protection from everything for a turn. I don't think that's going to help us out right now, though. Union of Third Path. No. What's Refinery do? Whenever another non-token artifact goes to the graveyard, or it does, be a token. Okay. So that would help us churn out a bunch of Power Stone tokens. Really feeling any particular one of these. Ooh, Perimeter Patrol might be okay if we went green. Uh, yeah, I kind of just... Could make up my mind quickly enough there, so I'm going to set that green guy to the side. Oh, there's a weak, weak stone getting passed to us. Maybe blue is more open than I thought. I'm going to pick the weak stone subjugation for some more removal. Maybe I end up in blue-white. I could still rage for colorless. So that's a thing. Keeper of the Cadence is back. Yeah, I told myself I wouldn't do a millstone. So tempting. Not going to do it, though. Keeper of the Cadence... 2-5, that's not that great. You like the idea of getting first strike, but Keeper of the Cadence is at least a creature. Ooh, another Might Stones animation. I feel like that's going to be really strong because it also draws a card. Scatter Ray does deal with a lot of BS, though. Archaeologist, okay. Maybe Blue-White is more open? I'm going to go with the Subjugation, though. Or the Subjugation, the animation. Her. Okay, we are not seeing a whole lot of black here, so that is drying up quick, are seeing some late white, so maybe I'm not thinking about that well strongly enough. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up in case I am wrong. Counter a spell, all right. Sack an artifact to create two and draw. Okay, no. Yeah, I guess the rebuff. I another blue creature. Nothing that great. Oop. Got a glitch here. Can't see what I'm looking at. No. And Mishra's Domination sideboard. Well, that went completely differently than I thought. Blue and white. Start out with some strong black. Speaking of, there's overwhelming remorse. There's a uh, green white. I got okay. So I've been looking at these two colored uncommons that seem to be definitely strategies for building your deck around. And this is one of them. If I was going green white, I have no green though so far. Bon shaman. That seems because if I pass that, green's definitely open is what I'm saying. That eh, overwhelming remorse, though. I don't want to snap that up now in case I that's going to be pushing black even harder. Uh, Yeah, I still think I want overwhelming remorse more than I want to first pick the dissident. Ooh, being able to make my creatures bigger, though, that's pretty cool. But I'm going with overwhelming remorse. I still think that was a smarter one to pick. It may just be in blue, white, black. Semblance anvil. Okay, I can make my things cheaper. What'd they pick instead of that? So they picked a common, passed all three uncommons. Don't think that mask is going to do me any favors. Steal and oil, I'm good. Lay down arms, exile target creature. Oh, okay. Yet another white removal. Semblance anvil. Mm, tempting because it does make things cheaper and it's an artifact that I could sack if I need to, but I'm going to go with lay down arms for more removal. And getting past two rares. Disciple of Gix. Okay. Phalanx guard. Right. There's the black card if I want to push that. Let's see. The temporal anchor. What does that do? Beginning of my upkeep, scry two. Whenever I choose put one or more on the bottom, I exile that many cards. All right. During my turn, I can play those exiled cards. It is an artifact, so it sticks around. Interesting. I don't think that's going to do me what I want in the draft. At least not limited format. Third path savant. Seven to draw two cards. Okay. Still a two, three body. Got to hurry. Five, four. No, we are not going with temporal anchor. The infiltrator. What I'm going to pick because it can get bigger quickly as well. Another dissident. Okay, someone's eating good today with that. Their infiltrator. Ooh, another animation though. And an excavation explosion. Removal, removal. Ooh, I have choices to make, and I think blue, white, black is what I'm still going to go with. Oh man, these are some tough calls. One for one, one first strike. No. Ooh, speaking of artifacts, I can make into creatures. There's a refractor animation. Battlefield butcher. No. Another red removal spell. Ooh, corrupt is back. I didn't. I forgot about that. Battlefield butchers. All right. I don't. I want to evolving wilds this soon. I don't think so. Non creature, non land card. All right. I'm gonna go with the archaeologist because that would let me dig towards some of the other cards I want. So blue white is seeming more focused for sure. What does this do? Return target permanent I control. Oh, okay. So I can get some more use out of my unearthed creatures with the excavation. Interesting. 
thing. Draw two cards, discard, then create a tap power stone token. Ooh, that's key. The power stone token. Target non-land permanent. Bottom of their library. Ooh, five mana, but still removal. Take that. Disenchant. I still don't have one of those yet. Ooh, we got a prospector. Making power stones for five. Levitating statue. Oh, a flying artifact. Ah, okay, so you have to keep paying for it. Disenchant, though. I'm I'm going to go with Disenchant. So much artifacts. So many artifacts. I can... Ooh, Might Stone Animation. I will pick up a second one of those. Skull Flare number two. That'd be number three. Do you know what that does? Whenever a creature... Okay, I can pay one to draw a card, potentially. Maybe. A lot of red going past us. I don't think I'm going to play with any of these, but I'll go with the supply... The cement... Bleh. Symmetry Matrix. Hey, the Semblance Anvil came all the way back. Pick that up. I don't think I'm going to play with any of these other ones. Yeah, I'm not going to. So I'll go ahead and pick the rare side. I don't think I'm going to play with it, though. Perimeter Patrol, green and some red here in the last few picks. I suppose I will go with... Not going to play any of them, but I guess I'll go with the Gnarl Root. I guess nobody's in green-white. Okay. Uh, sure, I'll take a super late dissident. Maybe somehow I'll be in green-white. Then I'd be having to kill all that blue, so probably not. Probably not. And down to the dregs. I'm throwing these down. Not going to be playing with those two. Domination. And we got a Chain Dancer for our last pick double strike to the side all right we got a gix okay well crap uh all right well don't think i can so many good things gix there's a thop opter Ar architect mm, well i want a gix and so oh there's a foundry inspector make my other artifacts cheaper i don't have a lot but that's still good okay uh i don't think i can I think I want to pass Gix. He's so good. Three for three, three that gets to potentially draw cards. Uh, Doctor Art. Of, yeah, I'm taking Gix. Might be able to make. Hey, all right. Ooh, I am all over the place. It feels like that Gix really threw me for a curveball. Was not expecting to open that last pack. Tactician that gives my other soldiers. And I do have some soldiers. A lot, but a couple. Hey, but if I'm Ooh, there's a rager though. Don't think I'm gonna tough call because I don't know if I want to feel like I need to force black because of Gix, but at the same time, that tactician though would do some work. Be pushing the blue white. I think the smart thing to do is blue white because yeah. Ooh, okay. So we got several options. We got another disfigure for some removal. Got a perennial behemoth. Seems okay. Hero of the Dunes. Boy. Okay, so I could return so many good options here. Still think disfigures where I'm going to go because I want to, maybe I'm just blue, black, and white. This is the worst. Okay, maybe my blue isn't as awesome as I thought it was, but still, still am leaning towards black though. A big thopter. Okay, we got a curate, another infiltrator, power suit. Good. Second disenchant though. I'm definitely playing with white. I am torn between black and blue. I might just have to stick to blue, white, but... Mm. All right, so I'm picking I'm picking the disenchant because there's just so much artifact and remote and enchantments in this one with the multiverse. That's pretty cool. I don't think that's gonna be good for draft, but ooh, we got a cavalry here. Hey, maybe blue. This, I'm having a heck of a time. I can't decide between blue and black. One with the multiverse sounds like it'll be fun in other formats, but I do not think that's gonna do me any favors right now going with that one though airlift chaplain not a soldier but it is able to do a lot of work i can put a planes or a creature into my hand otherwise i can make them bigger i think that's what i'm gonna do okay so i got 10 seconds here to decide black cards i got one two three four okay so i don't I have wasted a few picks on black so let's see what's this look like if i tie those to my board then if I go blue white specifically, I think I'm more ready. I could splash black for the removal. Okay, we got a haywire mite. Gain two life when he dies. Okay, so that is a soldier. Um, adept, no. Gigamole, no. Yeah, I guess if I'm going blue white soldiers, that would be the one. The engineer gets me another token when it dies. Probably not gonna play the guard? No. Now I'm gonna go with the engineer two for a 2-1 that makes a token when he dies. Okay, so blue-white definitely feels the most open. I've got Thopter Art... Arch bleh. Thopter Artitech. Architect. I can speak. I have a handful of artifacts that'll make other creatures fly. Another subjugation, though. Ooh. No, actually, animation. I want the animation. 
make my other power stones into four fours sold that's three of those Ooh, i could have a fourth one that's gonna be really good though so yes i'm gonna pick that okay i don't think i need five of them okay i'll make another Ooh, another soldier though with lifelink <whistles> mm. still gonna go with the power stone creator i've got all of those white stones animations power suit it's bigger no curate yeah put the sideboard though another one drop soldier sure yeah we'll put that there union of third path not gonna play with it and the very last fog of war all right deck building time i really thought black was gonna make the cut there but awesome as gix is i don't think that is the smart thing to do to play with it and i have all of these blue white options Four cards to cut. What are we going to cut? What are we going to cut? Scrapwork Rager still does draw a card. I can unearth it for black. Mm, I still think I need to cut that, though. The Refractor, not as necessary. I mean, I can make it make it a 4-4, four, four, so maybe. Architect will stay. Engineer will stay. Disenchant will stay. So removal. I've got plenty of that. I think I lay down two disenchants. Urza's rebuff is pretty much cancel or tap two things. Okay. Got two prison sentences. So that brings me up to what? Five. Desynchronize would be six. Mm. And a subjugation. Let's see. Three cards got to go. I am a little bit heavier on the two drops. I guess maybe the refractor does go. Okay, two more, two more. I think the paratrooper might have blue-white soldiers is kind of my overall theme here. Don't want to get rid of that, plus he can pump everybody. Maybe I get rid of one disenchant. No, there's too many artifacts. I think rebuff goes away. It's, I mean, cancel's okay, but I never play with cancel usually that often. One more card. The how many ways do I can make, make power stones though? Three ways there. Okay, so I think I have too many might stone anim animations for the amount of artifacts I can make. So I'm actually going to go down to two of those. Change something up. If I decide to splash black, that would allow me to do the rager, and I could unearth that. Oh, would that work like I wanted to? If I unearth it, and then I do an animation on it to make it a four four. I would have to sack it at the end of turn, but it would be a 4-4 that I could draw a card when that enters. That's not that great. And never mind. Okay. I am thinking I keep that Rager, though, because even casting it once is still worth it. Three tokens. Okay. I think that is what I do. Really want... Oh, mm -hmm. Those two cards made it really hard to not go with black and a disfigure. Ugh. Yeah, it hurts. It hurts a lot. I'm trying to think of any way that I could have made that actually work see i don't have enough black i've got one two skull players okay three four disfigure all right let me try what would that let me see what would it look like if i got rid of blue actually just pretending blue be gone play with disfigure play with infiltrator both skull flares dog moth overwhelming remorse okay, maybe i can do that actually i'm not feeling it really just don't want to pass up Gix. And I don't have as many artifact sources as I thought I did for the animation. Gix, it just seems like a better pick. Sure. Semblance Anvil would let me do what? I'd make a few things cheaper. The main reason I was sticking to blue-white was the tactician to give my soldiers plus one, plus one, but I've only got one tactician, and I feel like Gix is way stronger than just a lord effect for the one, one. Ugh, I don't think I can resist playing Gix. Plus, that gives me Disfigure and Remorse, which is better, I think, than what would I be giving up? One Subjugation, Remorse is better. Yeah. Maybe I add in the Matrix. Pay one, draw a card whenever power is equal to its toughness. Works, that works. No, yes, no. Okay, so that would only work with about half my creatures, so probably not. Hmm. Don't really want to play with Union of the Third Path, though. I think I just play with Semblance Anvil and imprint a creature to make it cheaper. Maybe. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So I think I'm going to go with black, white instead, because I still think that is going to be stronger. I have many sack outlets, though. Mm, just the one with the unearth <sighs> decisions. If I go with black, white. That's what I would be rolling with right there. If I went with blue, white, it would be more the soldier theme. Mm, this is a tough call. 
but I think what am I gonna do with all of those power stone tokens then if I'm not animating them that is such a tough call because I really think that's gonna be really strong four mana draws a card turning power stones into four fours is the goal hmm. yeah that's true I have no evasion with Gix okay so I get rid of that get rid of that put that back in put that back in two of those bottom that still play the rager though I could turn that into a four four it does just feel so bad not playing with Gix Ugh. I was hoping I would open him too. I mean, I can still use him in a constructed deck, just... Yeah, I think you're right. I think that's a smarter thing is probably to play with the blue-white as much as I want to play with Gix. Yes, that is definitely not a bad thing. All right, going with that. Checking this out. See how quickly it queues up. I'm guessing it's going to be pretty fast. First f &M. Yep. Wow. Joshua Forest. Here we go. Oof. Okay, no, that's not good. No white sources. One rager. Nope. Ugh. Good either. Oh no. All right, last mulligan. Okay. Work with that. Keep five. I will bottom the super expensive cavalry. And. Don't want to put get rid of my one drop, so I guess unfortunately the rager goes bottom. Yep. This way I can drop my planes and my survivor. And pass the turn. Ooh. I drop my island. Okay, so that's mana fixing. Got it. You have first strike. Okay, I've got one removal at sorcery speed. Planes, mine one. Tap to gain a life. Okay. Hmm. I don't like the idea of him making that a 4-4. Four four. I think the answer is to get rid of the mine worker. That's going to keep gaining him life. No, no, the animist will keep making me problems. So I will gain. I can still do that, right? Exile target creature with mana value less than or equal to planes of one. One. Okay. Yep. I couldn't do it on that because that's two and I don't have two planes. And I will not attack because I have first strike and I can stop either one of those guys. Alright, come on. Third land drop. Oh. What is that? Target creature gains flying vigilance, lifelink. Ah, flying, of course. Ooh, turn three. Okay, we are going to give a prison sentence to that Steel Seraph. And they played that for its full cost, right? Or no? Pro no, they didn't. Prototype. Okay, they prototyped it. They get to pick one. Well, to prison with your Steel Seraph. And I will scry two. I will bottom two. Ugh. Lands. I will not attack. Way I can stop their two creatures. Two forests. Hmm. What's that guy do? Creates. Oh, shoot. That's a lot of Power Stone tokens. Okay, he's going to get flying. Yep, I can't do anything about that. Hey, it's a planes. That is a soldier. 2-2 two, two first strike. I can stop all but one. And unfortunately, that prison sentence does not stop the beginning of combat trick. That sucks. But we'll leave it there. And ooh, what's this thing? Oh, they cast 
Oh, they power stoned it. Okay. They created a. Ooh, that's going to get out of control really quick. 3 2 flyer. Come on, disenchant. No disenchant. Okay. Refract. Draw a card. Let it be a disenchant. Come on, disenchant. <whistles> Got lucky. Okay. I think the answer is killing that Seraph, even though I already did a prison sentence on it, because I did not realize that that wasn't an activated ability. I should have realized there's no semicolon there. Okay. I can kill the Crusher, because that thing is going to get huge. Or something else is going to get huge, and it's going to be the flying huge thing. Alright, I think I just need to accept that... I should get rid of that. Because I cannot deal with him making a super big flyer every combat. Ooh, there we go. No attacks. Oh, that's right. They can tap that just to gain a life. Okay. See what you did. That's just a 3-2 now that he's got his power stones. That just lets them tap the power stones for whatever color mana they want. Still have another disenchant. I still have the bottoming blue spell. Another prison sentence that could come my way. Or they could just drop a clay champion. Gross. Oof. So this looks like green white super ramping. A lot of mana. Well, I can't stop those, but I can first strike that, right? Yes. And I would be taking four, eight if I don't block. Yeah, I don't want to get rid of my tactician. All right. And that's not going to do enough to save it for me. Dang it. Still can play him though. That's gonna be five. Yeah, that's that's lethal coming my way. Uh, well, good game to them. Whew. Okay, even if this blue white deck does not get me any wins, I did get a Gix, and I was really wanting for the collection, so that way I can try out standard deck ideas. I do not see me. Yeah. Getting through that huge line they've got there. Hey, I can exile to scry too. <laughs> sure. Yep, I was definitely dead. Dead, dead, dead. Alright, good game. I will let them do that. Let's see. No. And block. Well, they got me. Yeah. Boom. All right. Well, lessons learned. Let's see, is there anything I could swap in between that I want to do? I don't feel like I needed that refractor, but then again, I didn't see any of my white stones animations. Counterspell would not have. I think that would have been the trick. I think I just had un, another bad luck on the draw. Two mulligans definitely hurt. All right, let's try this again. Oh, that's that big flashing Thopter battle wagon, I think. 
I remember it had flash and it made your other cards have flash. All right, Vanish, let's go. Well, I got <laughs> two mana again. Uh, so I can do one, two, two things. Hmm, that gives me two turns to hope I draw lands. That's not feeling very good. Hmm. If I mulligan, I definitely am looking for three lands. Decisions. I'm going to take a gamble. I'm going to keep it because I can do two. These two things. Turn one, turn two. Let's see what they do. They're going first. Maybe they're going first. What was that? Oh, it's my turn. What the hell? Okay. I thought it was their turn. Glad I caught that. I thought I was hitting past to let them go. And immediately subjugated. Okay, that's how it's going to be. And I did draw a land, so yay. Um, yeah, might as well attack. It will not untap. I will use that as a... I can still use its ability, though. For four mana, look at the top. Oh, yep. And I will just swing for two. Okay. What are they going to do? Opportunist. Let's go ahead. I'll go to combat and see what they do. Doubt they're going to trade, but maybe they will. They have a 3-2. If they trade, then they trade. If they don't, then I'm going to do a Rager. Rager it is. Try and get a little bit of that card draw, or uh, get, get that card advantage. Plant work. That gets bigger for three mana. Sure does. Okay. It's looking for the other parts. It doesn't. They don't have that yet. Good. Hmm. Don't know if I want to use a prison sentence on that plant worker or not, because that way they can't activate those abilities. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to attack with... engineer and no no I don't want to do that uh, too late okay I'll get a power stone out of that I just duh they can block with the power worker plant worker and I will do yep my bad get my power stone Put him back out, so at least this way I have another mana. Can't be spent on anything but artifacts. Which I have none in my hand. That's not good. They've got one power stone. I've got one. They've got one plant worker. I think that's their biggest threat to me right now. What's that? All it tags in. Oh, okay. You just keep making power stones. Nice. Here's the third path savant and i th think wait can they just make that bigger instantly one two three they sure can so don't feel like doing a two for one 
Mm, I could unearth. Could chump and then get my own second power stone. Could have a counter spell as well. And make them spend the mana. No, I'll just chump that, get the power stone. Second power stone achieved. Still no animation. Dang it. How much mana do they have? One, two, three, four, five, six. I think I am going to go ahead and prison sentence that plant worker. Don't want either one of those. Yeah, good thing we did that. Scrying two, bottoming both. And I think I just sit tight. Nope, oh, not attacking. No attacks. Now they are... What are they doing? Are they going to draw us two cards? They'll probably do it the last second. Oh, my turn. On planes. I'm going to save that for their biggest threat. Meantime, don't have any other soldiers that I can feel good about putting counters on, so I will put... My retrieval agent out and I'm going to pass the turn no attacks yep draw their two cards that could be worth bottoming if they keep that up or no that thing ward four Ugh. Gross. I don't like that at all. Because that would take nine mana to bottom. Woo. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Disenchant? No disenchant. Well, okay. I do have that gross amount of mana, though. Four, five, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I could technically do it. They are tapped out in case they have counter magic. Hmm. Yeah, screw that guy. Hey, I will take that on top. Bottom that. I will turn one of my power stones. Oh, that's subjugation, not animation. I will subjugate something. No attacks. What will I subjugate? Ah, how about that guy? Yes. And I will also pay that. Oh yeah, they did put it right back on top. It has been a long day. I just could not resist drafting, even though I'm beyond exhausted. <laughs> I wanted to check out the bro draft so bad. And I am misreading cards all over the place. Uh, I don't want to attack. No, no thank you. Fourteen, two nineteen. So I'm not dead yet. Hey, I remember that elsewhere flask. That used to be in my time sieve deck or time sieve deck. That was back. Jeez, it's been a while. Good lord, there's dropping their hand. Okay. I see you have a lot of dudes. One, 
That thing has defender. Okay, so at least it has defender. Uh, yeah. Guess I need a flyer out because I don't think they have a way to deal with flying right now. I will make that soldier bigger. And they can get that thing. No, it is. It's already got the plus two. All right, so I don't have to worry about it pumping. That, I don't have to worry about. That's going to be a problem. Gaining life every time they tap it. That's not a big deal. That's a problem. Hmm. I think I just wait. I f do my flying next turn. I do have four mana though. I can start utilizing that recruitment officer's ability at the end of their turn. <gasps> That's pretty good. Oof. Uh. Well, I mean, I suppose they could reanimate my crappy creatures. What do they have in their graveyard, though? They don't have anything. Okay. I have no answers to that. That's... <laughs> That's gonna be bad. Sacrificing three creatures? Alright, at least activate my ability. And... nothing. Cool. All right, so we're sacrificing one, two. I don't want to sacrifice three. Three's too many. Gross. Uh. Yeah. Super sad. Well. Hey, it's a prison sentence. Hmm. Uh, I think I put that on their Savant so they don't get to draw two cards every turn. Yeah, I see you eyeballing that with your Phyrexian portal. Portal to nonsense. Okay. Gross. I'm going to get rid of their ability to draw two cards every turn. They are thinking with portals, and I don't like it. Ooh. I can put... Oh, that's if milled that way. No. Well. Let's see. I can fly over their head for three, though. Yeah. Got him. is surveil oh it's like scry okay so they're going to use that surveil to oh nope he's stealing my retrieval agent what no. that's my thing ow uh oh ow Okay, they have no cards in hand, and I have planes. Cool. Alright, two, three, four. Surveilling. I have no way to deal with all this now. Well, even if I went with the black-white idea, I don't think I'd be doing a heck of a lot better. Okay. Yup, that's a whole lot of damage that I have no way of stopping. I want that portal to Phyrexia, that thing is so cool. I would like a paper version of that for my commander deck. Rust Goliath. Whoa! Oh. Oh. Reach! Oh, because <laughs> it's so freaking huge. 10-10, just swatting my... 
Calvary out here. Oh, good. An island. That that solves everything. Portal to Phyrexia. Oh, come on. You have... Okay, he has no creatures. Bum, 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 bum. Dead. All right. I grossly underestimated how easy it would be to uh, get huge artifacts out. Power stones are uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, you know what? F it. I'm going to see what would have happened. Blue be gone. I'm going to sideboard out half my deck. Because I want to know how this would have worked. Where's the other cards I was going to use? Oh, shit. How was I going to make that work? Okay. Lands. How many is that? 14, 8. Minute sideboard. I don't what stop looking at lands. I think I'm playing with all the cards, so gross. That, no, that's... Screw it. Semblance Anvil. This is mostly because I don't think I was doing any better with the blue-white. So, try something radically different and see if Gix... If Gix actually wins me a game, I will be thrilled. Okay. Black Lotus. Well, I already have a better start. We will keep that. And passing the turn. Ooh, I am still reading all these cards. Oh, okay. It's the hey, it's Gix. Yes. And it's coming together. They did not. Living statue. Okay, I saw that pass around. Ooh, good thing I just drew an disenchant. I'm... Hmm. Let's see if they block that first. Guessing they don't. They don't. Cool. I will throw down a chaplain. They fly. No, oh, my swamp. Um, I will keep the survivor. That way, if I get my second swamp at the moment, I have something that can fly over and potentially trigger the Gix. No blocks. You got it. Ow. Wings. Uh-oh. I don't like you having flying anything. I don't like it at all. Can't do anything about it yet, so... Yes! Gix is out. At least he isn't dead yet. I don't... I have two planes. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that before they make it fly. Yes. Two Gix triggers. Hmm. Got planes. 
and an energy refractor. Well, already this is doing better than my blue-white did, so... That wasn't supposed to work. <laughs> cool. Do I have to sideboard that whole thing again? Oh, I better check. Okay, good. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Turns out sideboarding an entire color out of your deck was the right decision to do. Sometimes. All right, let's do this again. Hey, one victory, and it was because of Gix, so I'll take it. <laughs> that was so unexpected, but I am so happy that it happened. All right. Yeah, I was not expecting that to just line up perfectly, but it did. It did. Ooh, Zorak. Did it... He looks lost. Well, I can work with that. Indeed. Thank you, Gix. We will keep this. Do -do -do. Keep. And on its turn, not mine. Thinking about it. Come on. Okay. They discard a co oh, they're mulliganing. Okay. And island. I don't like islands. Uh. Is a pretty sweet Cerebus, though. Blue black. Oh no. I will drop my own black card. And an engineer. Unless they have a. Is there a counter for two? I think there is. Or is it three? What is that? No! Two one flyer. Oh, okay. At least it bounces its own creature. Thought it was gonna bounce mine. Okay. Well, they got a flyer, and I don't yet. Yep, you got me. Two. Come on. What the hell? Ow. Yeah, that would be way too good for two mana. I'm reading things differently. And, but I'm glad that I read that one wrong. We'll, however, get in the chaplain. Oh no, a disenchant. That sucks. Oh, a 2-2 two -two flyer. Even better. I will go ahead and hit him for two. I think I will indeed trade if they so choose. Four cards in hand. Ooh, they got their own retrieval agent. Okay. Thinking I will rage with this guy next. Hmm. They are up by six life. That is a flyer. Don't think I want to get rid of that yet, because if I have a Gix, that's a flyer that I can do stuff with. Taking two damage is not cool, though. Uh. Hmm. I'm going to take a risk and no blocks this time. Ooh, yeah. Give a... Give a prison sentence to... 
that guy. That way he can't activate his ability either. Um, yep, and I'm glad because I do not want either one of those. See, I can go ahead and attack for two on the ground for sure. It'll hit me for another two, but get four in there. Next turn, I could do some remorse. Wait. Creatures in my graveyard is zero. So that would still be five. And what is this nonsense? Oh, when I cast a spell. Cool. I have multiple spells and no disenchant yet. Okay. So... First off, I am going to still do this. Kill that. I will discard a card. I will discard a planes. And swing for four. Alright, we're getting a little bit closer here. 14-12. Still doing better with my black-white than my blue-white. Even with painful nonsense over there. And what's this? Flying and haste? Okay, so they want to bottom something? Go for it. Oh, nope. Uh-huh. Bet that's going to get bigger. That 2-4 flying, though, is ruining my day. Ow. Well, what am I going to discard? Probably the engineer. Or the flare. Eh. Either one of those. Um, I'm going to discard the engineer. Hey, there's my Gix. Although at this point, I probably don't want to be paying a whole lot of life. They're going to hit for two next turn. They got a chump with the Thopter. Oops, that, what tricks did they got? Two cards now. Quandary is pain for sure two gets through for sure and apparently three is going to get through that's going to become an an ornithopter with wings <laughs> okay and a useless ivory tower for them okay that's fine Three. Ow. Oh good, a semblance anvil. I will use that to discard. Okay, so I got six on the board. Okay, they're going to hit me for three next turn. I'll do it once for a disenchant. Oh, disenchant. Hmm. Disenchants are in the graveyard. One. Oh, what are the odds I'll get one? Hmm. If they have any pump spells, I'm boned. Got one turn to live. I have to decline. Too low. Three in the air is going to be a problem. But if they swing with both, then I've got lethal on the board.
Okay. They just let me win? What do they got? Oh, I don't like it. They got some sort of BS going on. Alright. Find out what nonsense they have. I'll leave one flyer to block that so maybe I don't die. Oh! Cool. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I side out blue and Gix again. I could have just stuck to black white. Okay. Two wins. I'll take it. Let's go again. I was not expecting that massive of a sideboard to actually work. I was just at the point of frustration, like, F it, let's just do it and see what happens. And turns out that's what I needed to do. It's not bad. I don't understand how I'm winning, but I swear my luck with the black-white uh, card draw at the start is uh, drastically better. I am noticing my last two opponents, though, I think have been copper level, so maybe. Okay, Gix is in my start in hand. All right, I can I can live with this. Sure. Up. Ah. Okay. Live it up. Two one. Let's go. Okay, dropping that swamp. Swing for two. Get it. Get that two. Got it. I could flash in a flyer though. No? I'm gonna do an engineer. Next turn will be a Gix again. Ooh, a two one flyer. Okay. Gix. X. Ooh, two triggers. Take action. Do it again. Wait. No, explosion. X, you will be missed. Womp. Well, I am not wasting that remorse on that guy yet. Right? I need another planes. I still attack, though. I think, depending on what they do, I will either flash in the paratrooper or overwhelmingly remorse their Kazia onulet. That's a dude. I don't like that dude. Go ahead and attack. You do that. Bet you're gonna feel overwhelming remorse about it. Yeah. Yeah, you gain two life. Ow. Ooh, a prison sentence. Okay. I will save that for something a little more dangerous. Going to attack for four, though. And... Drop another engineer. And we're just going to go wide with another... With another... And infiltrator. Okay. Game life. Hey, Swamp. Hey, okay, I've got six on the board. Protection for multicolored. Well. Okay. I'm going to... Heck. 
See which one they chump. And I think I'll just throw down another engineer. Oh, here we go. Tokens everywhere. That's a problem. I... I think I rage? Yes. Hey, disenchant. I will let them attack after. Okay, so they got four one ones and a two two flyer. They could trade all of their tokens for my engineers. That would not be good. Hmm. I do have a flyer and a prison sentence, though. Hmm. Yeah, no attacks in case they decide to pump last minute. Save that, and I will flash in the paratroop right end of turn. Depending on what they do. Okay. Not expecting that. Fine. Ooh, what is that? A red source or artifact, it deals... Oh, okay. That's getting disenchanted. That. No more. And... Ooh, another flyer. But first... Prison sentence. Getting rid of that. Ooh, a disfigure. We will keep you. And I'm going to... I'm going to go ahead and put the paratrooper down because he's got two toughness. Attacks. That's not going to be able to do anything. That is a problem. No trample, that's good. Haste is a... yeah. Gross, okay. So, paratrooper blocks one of those. Um... That doesn't have unearth. Trade those two, get rid of that. I would take two. No, I don't want to do that. All right, he's tapping all out. So save one. Tapped out. Okay, that would have me taken one, two. I can handle two. I can use the paratrooper to pump my dudes for plus one, plus one. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay, I think that's the answer. They're tapped out. Yeah, unearthing rager is also lethal. All right, do that. And... That can't block, right? I'm not crazy. 
Okay, it can't block. And we swing for lethal. Come on. Sweet! Three victories. And Gix was not the reason this time. I'm just paranoid. I was thinking, I'm like, what are they going to do? There's got to be something I'm not catching. Hey, we've ranked up even. I can definitely say this is the first time that that drastic of a sideboard actually worked. I think it's mostly been luck, but still, I mean, we're still going. Was not expecting to see going loss, loss, and then turning it around, but I'll take it. And back to a silver opponent. Yeah, sideboard an entire color out of your deck. Turns out strategy. Okay, this is more what I was expecting. This kind of nonsense. Swamp and everything that I can't cast. Yeah. Okay. Let me mulligan and let's move on with it. Mulligan. Two lands, okay. Disenchant. Survivor. Yeah, I guess I'll make that work. Get rid of the Skull Flayer? Yeah. I guess the Skull Flayer. Don't really want to get rid of him, but... Choices are made. Hey, okay, Forest. Oh. Is it going to be big stompy dudes, or is it going to be green-white tokens? Or red-green aggro? Okay. Yep. Bonk. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Well, I'm glad that didn't get up. Sucks for them, but take it. Uh, yeah, a three-two. I don't like that. Um, I don't know. Is that worth prison sentencing already? Maybe. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I want to scry for some lands. I will keep prison sentence number two on top, though. Oh, good. That's what I like to see. It's rage. Hey, Swamp. Wing for one. Bonk him. Ooh, not bonk him. Oh no. My first strike. Only works for one. Okay. Ooh, that's a bigger dude. I don't like that either. Hey, I can just disenchant that, though. In fact, I will. And... I'm going to attack. Let him, let him chump if he wants. He doesn't. Okay. In that case, I'm... Throw down engineer and an officer. Hmm, too bad I didn't have a disenchant to kill all of his precursor golems at once. On disenchant number two, bushwhack. Well,
don't like any of these. Hmm. Okay. There's a problem. Do I prison sentence one? Fortunately, that won't target all of them at the same time, like a disenchant would. Um, scrying two would be really nice, though. And in fact, I'm going to do that because I need need to dig for something. Ooh, disfigure. Yes. Do that. And no attacks. Always scry two at some point if I need. Eh. Okay. Huh. That's uh pretty good. Pretty good. It red, so it's going to get trample and haste. Disgusting. Yep. Oh my. He did all the things. Well, I guess I'll discard a card. And they're going to draw a card. I guess I opened one of, one of him up um, in a promo pack. He's pretty good. Pretty good. Well. Trample is not cool. But. I uh, would rather take that now. Not looking good. Not looking good. Get this figure. All right, so I'm taking one, two, three, seven damage. If I unearth, I'll take another damage, and I'd be what? Hoping to get another disenchant? Maybe. Ugh. Yeah. And that is not a disenchant. It is a dude, though. Yep. Well, not over yet, but that's not it. Not doing me any favors. And I'm going to take six. Too little, too late. Go ahead and scry to... Yep, those aren't going to help me. No attacks. So I have one turn of chump blocking. That was pretty, pretty good. That serpent. Well, they win. I'm not coming away from that. So I'll still take the three victories, though. Um, that was unexpected to get any victories with that massive of a sideboard. But I will take it. Claim that prize. So we still get a thousand gems though, and I used a draft token for it, so hey. Bonus thousand gems and two packs. So let's go ahead and crack those two packs open. Claim that. Alright. Claim prize. Let's check it out. What do we get? Ooh, I got five packs total. Well, I will open up two now, and I'm gonna save a couple for later. See what we get for the two that we won. Ooh, what is that? Okay. Turn all non land permanents to their owner's hands. End the turn. Huh. 
guessing that's probably not going to be standard worthy, but interesting. Falling vermin. Oh, okay. And, ooh, a mox amber. I wish I had one of those in paper. I don't know what I'm going to use that for, but I like having moxes. That's pretty freaking sweet. Nice. All right, let's see what the second pack is that I'm going to open. And... Earned a wild card. Flow of knowledge, recommission, power blade. Already got those from the draft. All of Krug. Droid target land. Oh, okay. And loyal bodyguard. Legendary creature pumper, huh? Hmm. Still two for a 3-3, three, three, though. That'd still be decent in draft, right? Even if you don't have any other legendaries, but if you're red-green, not bad. Well, all right, let's see. What other tokens I've got? I'm done with that one. Stop. Okay, so I still have a draft token I can use because I did the uh, brother Brothers War pre-order just to uh, get the battle pass. All the when I did the math for how much it costs on gems and wanting to be able to record a bunch of drafts, I figured that was worth it. It's sealed though. I have not done a sealed yet. So let's see. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and stop the first recording. So pausing that.